G'day Jedi Knights and Sith Lords, Ricky Retro here and welcome back to G uh, Star Wars Jedi Fallen Order. Um, in the last video I've just been mucking around on this planet called, uh, what's the name of the planet? Bogota or something like that? Uh, hang on, I can tell you in a second. Bagano. And uh, yeah, uh, just uh, got to the outskirts of the vault and so now I'm about to enter the vault and see what to do. And here we go. is a structure that has been here for centuries it appears to be the only way it appears the only way to open the vault is by using the force oh wow okay amazing um i just go up some kind of elevator or something where do i go now Hey, BD-1. Just checking on you. <laughs> hey, whoop. Oh, okay. What's this? Scan it. You all right, BD? Well Did done, I? whoever you are. You have passed the test I left behind and gained access to the vault and this recording, <coughs> one of many encrypted logs stored in the droid. I am Master Eno Cordova. I may not know your name, but I know your purpose. The fate of the Jedi Order lies in your hands. This place, this vault is a sacred temple built by a vanished civilization known as the Zephyr. Meditating here, I was granted a premonition through the force, a vision of doom. I have placed inside this vault a Jedi holocron containing a list of the names and locations of young force sensitives throughout the galaxy. Shit. I you will find the inner chamber of the vault, but also another test. I can only trust this holocron to someone who has followed my path and understands. Seek out the hidden tombs of the three sages and learn to perceive the mysteries of the Force as the Zephyr once did. In this droid, you will find everything you need to succeed on this journey. Go to the Zephyr homeworld. There, you will find peace in the eye of the storm. Good luck, Jedi. And may the Force be with you. Okay. I'm guessing a lot of that was encrypt uh, was cryptic. I guess you were the someone I was supposed to meet. <laughs> you know, I've been alone for while now without any purpose just hiding there's no way to live not for a jedi or a droid maybe seer was right maybe we're done hiding hey you want to meet some uh Friends of mine. Okay, so my friend, my name, uh, 
constructed by the Zephyr millennia ago granted me a vision of the Jedi's doom. To preserve the order, I've hidden a holocron detailing the names and locations of all young Force sensitives deep within the vault. What, back then or now? To access the holocron, you must seek out the tombs of the three great Zepho sages. Betty One will aid you on your journey. He will be your guide. So I've got to go back to the ship. Why did I have to... Because I thought there was a whole bunch of stuff that I had to do. Huh. Okay. I think I found what you wanted me to see. Sounds like you did. We'll be waiting. Oh, shit. Damn it. I should have. Fuck it up, Kate. Oh, God damn it, I keep hitting the wrong bloody thing to. Mm. Yeah, that's cool. Get as comfortable as you want. So, this thing came back at me again. And I've got to get to. I don't know, the thing said go check out the Zepho. But hitting the wrong button to do the block or the parries okay but now I've got to get back to the ship which it do you see that It stays there. Oh! Hello. Another one? I'll check it out. The structure of these bones suggests a large reptilian uh, creature. Uh, an analysis. Analysis. <laughs> an analysis of elements within the bones date them as old as a thousand years. Okay. Another one there as well. Can I get up on top of it? No. Um, huh. <clears throat> Bandit. Oh! There's a workshop here. I can do something with my sabre. But what?
my friend. It appears the Zepho had some interest in Dathomir. Ooh, Strange. Dathomir. For such a peaceful culture to have any sort of fascination with a place so dark. to be discovered on Dathomir. Okay. A fatted neural located on uh, Bagano, not far from Zepho, uh, from the Zepho Vault. It likely represents a planet, but the artwork is too damaged to make out the specifics. But I don't want to go there just yet because there is something down somewhere here. It's probably under there. But I can't seem to get through. Lock tight. Hmm. Oh, shit. Okay. Got to do that wall walk stuff. There we go. Hang on, let's meditate here first. Should be a lot quicker than. I was trying to get through here earlier, but now, knowing what I know, I can get in there now. Pressing the wrong trigger. Oh, god damn it. There's gotta be a way up there. Done that the whole time. God damn. <laughs> the Jedi used this place to study the sphere above. I can still feel the excitement. Increase maximum force. Okay. Meticulous handcrafted notes on the energy sphere left behind by the researcher on Bogano. Bogano. Okay. So now what? Ah. 
Whoop. What the hell is going on here? Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. That's not an option. Um. No, okay. Bad idea. Okay, maybe there's a way through that way. And if not that way, this way. Oh, you. Is there a way through that way? Let's try to see if there's another way around. Snap, okay. Um here we go. Boom. <laughs> oh, hi there. Yeah, so it's not those Borg things, but Making a new friend. They're just as cute. They're called Boglings. Okay. That's what they're called. Uh, uh, trying to get comfortable, doubt, and... I don't know if... No, okay. They're pissed off. Hi. Hello. Oh, come on. Say hello. 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 Oh. <laughs> um. All right. I'm going to sprint and run. Oh, God damn. That didn't work. Why did that not work? Um. Ah, I know. Let's try. Oh, come on! Mm. What the... Whoop. Oh. Have I been down there? Sh what the frack is that? Oh, I know what that is. I've been down there before. Yeah, fuck that. Um, where was that zip line? I think maybe I have to come back to this planet? Damn it. Okay, let's try that again. Oh, 
Uh, what was that? And what were they running away from? I just got really confused here and lost a whole lot of health for some reason. I do not understand why. That's what that noise was, that dun 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 dun. the test. Did I? So you knew about BD-1? <laughs> Come on board. We'll talk inside. Oh, BD-1, this is Grease. Hey, Grease. What is that? <laughs> get off my sofa! Get, get off my sofa! Go! Get off my sofa! Get out! <laughs> that is BD-1. He's with us. I don't care who he's with. Do you have any idea how hard it is to get oil stains out of petroleum fabric? Not really. Oh. I hope you found something better out there than this droid. Oh, calm down, Grease. He did. Tell us, Cal. The vault was built by an ancient civilization called the Zepho. A Jedi named Eno Cordova hid something inside of it. What did he what hide inside? They are, they're poor, they're puffins. A holocron from the archives. <laughs> it contains a list of four sensitive children. The next generation of Jedi. I knew it! Ah, oh, Cordova, you old fool. You knew him? Yes. A long time ago. I was his apprentice. Cordova was a loner. And that little droid and I are probably the only ones that know about Pagano. Hold on, wait a minute, wait a minute. A hollow what? A holocron. It stores information, but only accessible to Jedi. Hang on, I think I have one around here. Use the Force. This is Master Obi-Wan Kenobi. I regret to report that both our Jedi Order and the Republic have fallen. With that list of Force Sensitives, we could rebuild the Jedi Order and defeat the Empire. Okay, no problem. Let's get it! Well, except the Holocron is hidden deep inside the vault, and to get it, we have to follow Cordova's path. He mentioned something about the planet Dathomir and a Zepho homeworld. All right, well, where are we going? I'm just asking because I was thinking of maybe making some food. Look, before we do anything, I need to know something. How come you're no longer a Jedi? I had an experience that changed my perspective. So I cut myself off from the Force. But you still want to rebuild the Order. I believe that rebuilding the Order is the best chance we have against the Empire. What do you believe? I believe I can't keep hiding from the Empire, so I don't really have a choice. Cal, as long as you're alive, you will always have a choice. Are you with us? We're in. <laughs> Come this far. That's the mirror's Zepho. It's your choice. After revealing she no longer uses the Force, Sarah Kara sent Cal to the ancient vault. Along with, uh, along the way, Cal fell in the Why is this? We know this. Okay. Um. Hmm. Dathomir is meant to be. D Dathomir is meant to be dark. Where are we headed? So that's Bogano, Bogano, Zepho. You 
You know what? I'm going to play it safe and say, let's go to Zepho. But before I do, there is something I forgot to get. Give me five seconds, I'll be right... No, well, give me ten seconds, I'll be right back. Yes, I know. It took a little longer than 10 seconds. I do apologise. Anyway, I'm thinking... Let's go to Dathomir. I reckon if I can nail Dathomir, then... Yeah. Um... Re-centre. Okay. Yeah. Oh, okay. Hmm. Oh, I pressed the wrong button. I was viewing map and I was viewing the map of there. Uh, let me see. Oh, one six, uh, secret two. Two out of 16 chests on that? Damn. Okay. I'm guessing I can go back and re-explore it. But... Zephyr I've got no idea about. Dathomir. Dathomir was the birthplace of Darth Maul. So, you know, I really want to... When I say birthplace, I mean, it's not like he was born in Dathomir, but Darth Maul became... Oh, does it? Where does it say go to Zeph Zepho first? Oh, you're right. It says search Zepho. Oh, okay. Well, I stand corrected. Thanks for pointing that out, Mel. Thank you. All right. Well, then that's where I'm going. But I... Oh, I... Can... I can't wait to go to Dathomir though, because yeah, Dathomir is the spiritual so birthplace of you think any Darth Jedi Maul. Will come out of hiding? Mm, what makes you think there are a Jedi hiding? No, I'm just curious. Is there someone specific you're thinking of? Well, growing up, we heard tales of a green, pointy-eared, legendary Jedi master, and are you talking about Master Yoda? Yes, he is very legendary. Wait, what? Who? No, no, I'm talking about Master Yaddle. The Jedi High Council member? Yeah, we all have our dreams, okay? <laughs> Let me have mine. <laughs> no problem. Time to land. Get up here. Don't know who the hell Yaddle was. <laughs> I'm blind. I was not gone two minutes, Mel. Stop exaggerating. Wow. That was quick. Think of a storm brewing down there. This might not be the best time to land. Yeah, something strange. Those winds are interfering with our comms. Hey, Cordova mentioned something about peace in the eye of the storm. Well, I can just make out a settlement in the middle of it. Then we have to get there. Copy that. Oh. Cup 
couple bumps ain't gonna kill you, kid. <laughs> Unless the wind picks up. Can you tell that bucket of bolts to keep his opinion to himself? I'm sure everything's under control. <laughs> so it's under control? It's just a little tricky. <laughs> Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh! Huh. Perfect landing. <laughs> Crazy money, baby. Uh, but I'm still getting a lot of interference Crazy. on the comms. It's gonna take me a minute to get them back up. I'll search for signs of Cordova in the meantime. Good. I'll be in touch once I crack this. Cal, came back and forth. over here. You did good work on Bagano. The more information we gather on Cordova and the Zepho, the closer we'll get to stopping the Empire. I've heard of ancient cultures, but don't know much about them. I only knew that Cordova was obsessed with the Zepho, believing their teachings to be important. I, too, was intrigued by the mysteries of our galaxy. You better get moving. There's a lot to learn here. Good luck. Is there a workstation somewhere on... What's this? Hey, Grease, what's this thing? What? You've never seen a terrarium before? Sure, but don't they usually have plants in them? Well, I've been a bit busy... I have got one, I've been on. But you know, you could pay me back with some seeds. I thought you hated nature. When it's out there, you betcha. <laughs> but when it's behind a comfortably thick wall of bar and glass, that's perfection. All right, I'll see if I can find any. What, well, didn't I pick something up when BD scanned something? What, that's it? Hmm, okay, fine. But is there a workstation? Because I know there's an upgrade to my saber I can do. So let's, oh, is that it at the end? Yes! Yes! Okay. What can I do? Um, color. Emitter. Oh, okay. Oh, shit. Wrong one. Yeah, put it away, dude. It's a saber. You've had it with you for most of your life. Oh, I could go green. So green is for, for more of the consular. A consular is more strong in the force than they are in saber fighting, uh, which is blue. Saber fighting, you know, that's what you use with that one. That's usually for, your, um, what they call, uh, ah. oh, help me out here, Mel. You remember playing um, the Old Republic. Um... Ah, and it's already planted, okay. But green, yeah, the green saber was to represent those Jedi Masters or Jedi Force users who were more attuned or able to defend themselves or attack using the Force rather than using the sword. The sword was, uh, to them, or the saber to them, was more of a symbol with defensive properties, uh, but their attack was more forced, Force stuff. Okay. I think for now I'll keep it blue. But I think when it comes to force powers. I'll probably go for more force. Like when I get, get to upgrade. Rather than saber fighting, I think I want to use more force stuff. But uh, emitter. Yeah, okay. Uh, yeah, what? That is a good question. Why is Mace Windu's saber purple? Good question. And uh, there are several pages on the internet you could find on that to answer that question. I did read about it, um, as in the explanation they used. But ultimately, in the end, the only reason why that saber went came purple in the first place is because um, the actor Samuel L. Jackson told uh, George Lucas... Okay, look, you want me to be a uh, Jedi Knight? I want to be a Jedi Knight, but I mean, in this scene where you've got us, 
you know, because he's talking about Star Wars Episode 2 when Windu first uses his sabre, he simply said, hey, I want to be able to pick myself out of the crowd. <laughs> and hence, that's why Mace Windu has a purple sabre. <laughs> Otherwise, he would have been stuck with uh, blue, green or yellow or orange. So, yeah. Uh, wouldn't it be a mix of light and dark? You know, I'm not sure. I'm not sure, but I mean, after I finish with this stream, Mel, uh, I will send you something on it, or I'll send you a few pages on it for you to read at your time, but I just, I cannot tell you off the head, off the top of my head, because it was so long ago when I read about it, but originally, the reason why Mace Windu's saber was purple, was so that Samuel L. Jackson could pick himself out of a crowd of Jedi. <laughs> oh, shit, you not, that's, yeah. <laughs> Wait, does this... Is that all it is? It's just a change of... Huh. Because it says Valor and Wisdom 2. But does it give me any other power than that? Like, okay, so that's green. But that's blue. But this one says Valor and Wisdom, while that one just says Jara Tapal. Uh, Tapal. 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 Whatever. I'll go with that, but for now, it just seems to... That is a very good point. Red and blue make purple. So, yeah, it might be that balance between dark and light. But then again, on that... Based on that, don't you think maybe... Luke Skywalker's should have been purple? Considering he was the light and of the darkest... Well, not the darkest, but a very dark Jedi. It's, it's fun to think about. It is fun to think about. Because, I mean, you know, Luke Skywalker started off using his father's saber, which was blue. But then when you see him in Return of the Jedi, he's using one that's green. But I've got to... Um, no. Gifted to him by his former master, but it mm, tap to slow. Enables running. Yeah, okay, I know all that, but what is the pur purpose of just changing what my saber looks like as opposed to whether or not these upgrades actually give my saber any kind of benefit? Well, you know what? Who cares? Let's just. Yep, let's do this. I do not have a thing to spend, but I am going to save. And I've been fucking around on here for far too long. So, yeah, the next video I do is going to go for longer. You know what? It does actually make sense that I would change my Sabre Green if I want to go more force attuned than whatever. So, yeah. I'm going to go back and I'm going to change the colour of my saber to green. Because I'm just... I am such a Star Wars geek in that way. There we go. Alrighty. So yeah. That's already planted. That's what I had. I thought I had something else, but yeah. Um, should I talk to her? What should I talk to her about? I can see you two have been through a lot. It's not easy. No, it's not. But I think of those who believed in me at one point. If I give up on myself, then I give up on them. I'm sure you have a few of those. Prof. Uh, friend on Braca. He sacrificed himself so I could live. He believed in you. 
A lot of people depend on you, even if they don't know it yet. Keep going, Cal. For Prof. For everyone. She's got a point. Alrighty. So, which way? I'll go where the lights are green. And that does nothing. That does nothing. Here we go. Derelict hangar. Zeppo. What's this? Can't blame me for checking that out. It does look... It does look out of place. Yeah, okay. Um... Alright. Forgive me for... Oh, hello. Is that a... Yes, it is. Open it. Oh, all right then. <laughs> Something we can use? New poncho material. Oh, wrong one. Yeah, I'm not... No, uh, uh. Don't want to use new ponchos. Although... Okay. Oh, it looks all right, doesn't it? Hey, that's an Imperial symbol. I think we're going to run into some Imperial trouble here. Years on this rock and no artifacts to show for it. You could put in for a transfer. They don't give transfers, you know that. But of course it's locked. Let the officers worry about artifacts. Okay, so... The Empire seems to be interested in this shit as well. Oh, okay. No point jumping up there then. Okay. Aha! Hey, fellas, you guys just keep feeding on him. Watch out, BD. Don't look friendly. Oh, yeah. Take efficient, it may attack efficiently and yeah, will reflect shots back. Ah, see, here we go. It says so right there. I remember when uh, the Force Awakens came out, and then they see this uh, see this stormtrooper take his helmet off, and it's a black guy, and they're like, "Oh, what do you mean? That's not a clone?" Blah blah blah. And it's just like, "Oh, mother of God, he's not a clone soldier. He's a stormtrooper." Well, it says so right there. It's conscripted. From worlds across the galaxy, so yeah. Oh, can you hear me? The Empire. They found Zeppo. If they were following the Mantis, we would have been swarmed already. Could they be looking for the tombs? Let's hope not. Just got our comms working. I'll try the same workaround to crack into theirs. I think it's sealed. Hmm. Find something? Yeah, that one. Don't need it. Yeah. Let me see. Oh, okay. Here we go. Another fly coming up. Whoa! Damn! Woo! Nice job. What the fuck? Where'd you come from? 
Jesus, Mary and Joseph. Oh. I love how his light automatically comes on the moment you're in a dark place. Oh, damn. This got really dark. Um, no, that's not... There we go. Mother used this fabric to keep her child warm. They were on the run from something. I'm sorry, but that just that sound just made me uncomfortable. Dark place when you hear a baby crying, you usually hear that or see that shit in horror movies and games. Whoop! Gotta stop jumping like that. God. Mm. Stim crate should be here. Wait, can he carry more? Thanks, Speedy. How many does he have? Cool. Maximum number of steam canisters increased. Okay, cool. I've only ever seen one, but yeah. Where am I going? Where am I supposed to go? Okay, so the land... Ah, right, I see. And I'm trying to get in around that way because... Wait, didn't I just come through here? through here what the hell man oh okay I can climb down somewhere all right so let's climb what all oh, right there's nowhere down there to go been up there haven't I yeah okay let's not go around in circles again let's go back wait there's a stairwell over there okay god damn it Man. Okay, I see now. We've got to go back up. Back up where? Okay, great. Thank you. Shortcuts unlocked. Oh, okay. Did anyone hit 
Doorway here, can I get through here? No. Oh, okay. Come back. Stop here. pressing the X. Oh, something was in there. New emitter. Duty and resolve. But I don't know if any of that shit means anything. Like if it gives me extra powers, or what? Alright. <laughs> what have you got there, BD? Warning. This area is off limits, Imperial Code 94364, no selling or trading. Okay, what about hacking and slashing? Is that cool? Oh, okay. Did you see something? I knew that was going to happen. One swipe, boom. Um, need I a need stem. a heal. Thank you. Oh, hello. Um, Who was that? He's there, right there. Keep, keep your distance. Watch yourself. I love those cutscenes. It's what all lies. Eviction notice. Civilians must immediately report for relocation. Looters will be shot in accordance with Imperial Code. Pardon me, 94364. No selling or trading without proper authorization and explicit consent. This property and its belongings are now under the protection of the Galactic Empire. General Marcon, 201st... The Empire country. just wanted this land. Yeah, because I know there's some shit here. Okay, yeah. There's definitely some glitches that EA need to fix. <laughs> Yay! Uh, yep, I just came this way. Can I jump up? No. Can I? Yeah, watch me. Move it out. <laughs> yeah, I can't beat you, my fucking ass. I can't. <laughs> See that? The way he's just like, you know, doing that with his hand. Yeah, yeah. Got a scan? I 
able to block, parry, and use specialized spin techniques. Stronger stamina than their subordinates. Yeah, except I went around and just took the, both of them out in one swing. Yeah, he got a hit on me, but so what? Oh, hello. There's a couple of... Wait. Oh, okay, it's not a force echo, it's something else. Where are you taking us? I'll start. The Empire's forced the villagers from their homes. Frightened refugees, shipped off to work camps. Or worse. A pack left the villagers forced from a pack left by villagers forced them from their homes. By the Empire and shipped off to labor camps. Or worse. You know, I'm just looking around and shit, and I shouldn't really be doing that. I should be looking at, you know, where exactly my main objective is. Which... Huh, that's weird. place to go up there. Do I drop down here? No, that's water. <coughs> yeah, that moss is nothing I can climb up on. Oh, okay. Huh. I've got to get up there and walk across that. Shit. That was close. But how do I get up there? Something's around here because... Okay, I can't climb up that. The music. What's with the music? Take her and go. I'll lead them away. I'll start. No! Okay. Ah, here we go. Um, let's see if I can run this. Huh. Guess not. Uh, that's a locked door. That's a locked door. Uh, somehow I can get through there, but I've got to get over there, and I don't see how I can. I can't run over there. I can't climb up there. Let's. There's a stormtrooper over there that miraculously, out of all, after all this firefight, has not seen me. Can I climb up here? No. There are TIE Fighters flying around. Okay. Oh, okay. Okay. Here we go. Ha-ha. <laughs> oh, g'day, mate. How you going? Someone else take a hit. 
Gonna get shit, dude, because you're dead. Anything here? <coughs> no? Okay. No, nothing there either. Okay. Had to have a look. <gasps> but I've got to go through that door, I think. I hope. Yes, okay. And this is the stairway that leads away down. Okay. Oh, meditation. Sweet. And, oh, two skill points. Um, what is that? Empowered slow. Holding slow allows Cal to slow his target for a longer duration. So I'll hold that down. What's this do? Cal dashes forward and attacks his target. Jump while dashing to flip over the target instead. Huh. Let's get that up there. Because, yeah, I'm starting to take a whole lot of hits that can definitely take me down a hell of a lot harder. So, yeah. Um, I think I like my force powers better. Yeah, so hold, 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 and they go whoom, and that's when I go... Well, I wouldn't wait for him to do that. I'd go bang, bang, bang. But it does eat up a shit ton of force power. As I hold it down, then un... Yep. Okay. I'll use that in the next fight. Get my health up. And... Wait, what? Um, what? I've been here. in there. You are, ooh, Guardian. Above us? Got it. How can we win? You can't. So... Yeah. <laughs> 
there somewhere or somehow at least anyway where ah okay gotta go this way oh god damn it do I have to go back up there again how the fuck am I supposed to ah okay I see all right Boys, hello there. <laughs> did you see what I did there? I did that whole Obi Wan Kenobi shit. Oh, all right then. Yep, have a look around. Did you find something, BD1? New lightsaber sleeve acquired duty and resolve. But I just do not know if that has any bearing on shit. G'day! <laughs> Alright, so... Yeah, this way. And there is something up there. What is it? It is... A save point! Okay, cool. How radically I can change my lightsaber. I mean, then again, what are the benefits of it? So that's the thing that's really confusing me. It's just like I'm picking up all these things, but ultimately, in the end, is it purely cosmetic, or does it uh, does having a different crystal or different materials make my saber powerful in terms of deflection, strike, uh, force power? That I would like to know. Okay. What was that? Oh, okay. Get out, mate. Looks like a problem. What does? Oh, hi! Damn! Oh, 
Oh, man. Did you see that? I cut off his tusk. Oh, that is harsh, man. That is real harsh. Ah, okay. There's where the objective is. Cool. This is going to suck. Oh, great. Shit! Where did that rocket come from? Cal can block attacks in any direction while blocking. Yeah, but where the fuck did that rocket come from, man? Here we go. One more time. Ah, oh, okay. It's going to send me all the way back here. All right. Fine. Oh man, I'm loving this game. And so, coming back here. Gotta go back up here. Oh, what the fuck? Fair income. Wrong button. Jeez. Oh, I didn't scan him. Did I not scan him? Thanks, BD1. Okay. Feel like. Sorry I had to do that to you, mate, but you're the one that came at me like a bull at a gate. supposed to get past that and now I've got to go all the way back hmm I'll give it one more try before I call it a night because it's getting quite late here I mean I'd keep going if it wasn't just you know going through all of this like you know I could go there from when combat starts but then I've got to go through this shit. And, yeah. Thing always hurts now. 
Okay, so there's a rock dude up there. So maybe I can just... He's there, Ripton. We'll take you down. Hurry, end it! Uh, Wait, what the fuck was that? Okay, I didn't expect that. But I have to respawn. Back to where? Yeah, okay. Well, um... I'll try it again. You know what? Fuck it. No, I'm going to keep trying until I get through that, but... Yeah, that is just like a whole bunch of bullshit right there. I've got nothing I could possibly do about that. The rocket comes at me. And I don't know how to defend against it. I do parry. But it just explodes. It's not like it's a laser shit. I thought, yeah, sure, I'll go do this thing. Save her out. Yep. Unless, is there a, No, there isn't. Okay. Okay, so I've got a little bit more than that. Okay, great. So, now then. He's there, right there. Oh, wow. You got it. I think I'm done. Okay, here we go. He's just too far. We'll beat you. Make him hurt. End him. Contact on target. Back up, I've got this. They can't all be dead, can they? Okay. Did it. Fuck's sake. Not anymore, it's not. Found him. Charge forward. Damn it. Okay. Should I? Yeah, let's go get him. 
I want to try and get some force powers on me. Get it Is that it? Okay. There is someone. Oh, fuck. Is that a rocket, dude? You, you shouldn't be here. <laughs> <laughs> Learn how to defend properly. Look alive. Let's do this. Target is quick. Get him. Yeah, someone else take a hit. Get him already. One. Okay, well, let's go over there. Can you slice this? <laughs> oh, sorry Fuck's about your scoffling. But standing up to that bog rat, pretty brave. Hang on. All right, there we go. Okay. Uh, but this is going to resurrect those dudes, isn't it? Well, that's okay. I'll have a full thing of health. When I do, oh, and I've got oh, seriously? Oh, okay. Improve allowing him to take less blocked stamina damage from incoming attacks. Dashes forward and attacks his target. Jump while dashing to flip over the target instead can perform another powerful attack after the overhead thing. Oh, Christ, this is going to be a whole lot of button mashing shit, isn't it? Defense. I'm going to go with defense. I want to get my force power up in defense before I start, you know, because then I can block anything and then wait for the most opportune moment to completely do some damage. All right. Okay, here we go. All right, going to be doing this for a... Yeah. No one's that fast. You'll let your guard down soon. Another one? Find something? That'd be a cell trooper and he wants shit. But somehow I've got to get up there. But where do I go now? I've got to get up that way. But not this way. I've got to go this way. Okay. came over here, what for? What was that? What is that? I can't push it. What was that sound? Let's see what's this way.
Seer, there's a transport ship leaving the Empire's base. I heard. They plan to bring Zepho artifacts to Coruscant. Does that mean? That the Emperor is interested in Zepho? Maybe. Okay. Okay, whoever this Ostar is. Wounded, but he took out a trooper. What do we do if we run into a Jotas? Well, you cover me, and I'll run. Why should I cover you? Someone should survive. Might as well be me. Um. Okay. Can't go through that way. I've got to repair some shit. But it's not. Oh, hang on. Is this it? A little help. Nice assist. No, that's not what I meant. You still back there? Okay. Alright, so we'll go back down to that thing. We'll force slow that map, uh, that fan, and we'll go through that way. See? To it. Don't let that be Oster. Near Hiena. Uh, Take care of her, Sienna. Damn it. I mean, he's been dead a long time. And this is not the way to go. So, what the hell, man? How am I supposed to get through there? that way not that way either so hmm stomp link must be repaired to operate this where do I go to operate the stomp link repair Where do I go to repair the stop link? Or do I... God, you're so riled up today. Blasted scav stole my blaster. I got punished by the commander. Well, no need to be mad at me. Okay. Okay. Alright, I think I know where to go now. Gotta go this way and then do a force walk across the wall. And then up and over. That's what I should have done before. Have a look. Yep, this way. You're not getting out of here alive, Jedi. Your guard is pretty solid. Fucking hell. That was close. What's with the dramatic music, dude? That freaks me out every time you do that. Oh, okay. That's what's with the dramatic music. Gotcha. <laughs> Tell me, I didn't just fuck that up. Okay. <laughs> fuck you. Man, that was hectic. <laughs> hmm. 
Rocket launcher trooper. Okay. Makes sense. I think I saw a Chotas near here. If it comes around, don't you dare think of running again. If I hadn't, it would have killed me. At least you wouldn't die a coward. In accordance with the Emperor's will, we've occupied Zepho, redistributing its inhabitants. This planet has failed to yield significant data or relics for Project Augur. Its electromagnetic winds have rendered the bulk of our mining technology useless. Project Augur. stormtroopers lose their lives to dangerous fauna. We will not be able to fulfill our directive here. It is my recommendation that we disband the project and leave a token outpost to keep scavengers from stealing our technology. Okay, I think I'm on the right path to get to the objective. But somehow. Oh, g'day, mate. Ah, okay, I'm done. Hey, turn. Did you see that? All allied units down. The target is quick. Yeah, no shit targets quick. What? Whoa! Oh shit. Okay, fuck that up. Oh snap, okay. Damn it. Supposed to get up there. Oh, jeez. Ah, okay. Here we go. Shit. Ah, oh, damn it. I'm gonna die. Oh, I didn't die.
Okay, I am very, very confused here. So that don't work. do not know what I'm missing. Okay, I am... Wait, what? Okay, uh, well, yeah. This game has decided to give me the dick in the worst possible way so i am going to end the video here and uh, i'm going to look up i'm going to cheat because when the computer cheats with me or when the program cheats with me i cheat back so i'm going to look up on the internet to see how to get past that area but for now yeah i'm going to end the video here i was getting the really shits there because everything was looking fine and everything like that but there was just nothing there that was making sense as to how to get past that next bit so yeah uh but if you liked what you saw hit the like button if you want to see more and get notified about more hit the subscribe and the notification button and of course feel free to leave comments in the comment section below and until the next video take it easy or take it any way you can i don't take it any other way later legends